In November, when Twitter co-founder and CEO Jack Dorsey announced he was stepping down, he also named his successor, Parag Agarwal. A Twitter veteran, many saw Agarwal as a natural fit to replace Dorsey. Agarwal joined Twitter in 2011, following stints at Microsoft, AT&T, and Yahoo. He first worked on Twitter's ad team, where, using machine learning, Mr. Agarwal and his colleagues developed ways to target ads to users, which helped raise Twitter's revenues and his profile. By the time Dorsey returned to Twitter as CEO in 2015, Agarwal was already an influential engineer in the company, according to reporting by The New York Times. Mr. Agarwal also managed Twitter's effort to incorporate cryptocurrencies into the platform. In 2017, Twitter promoted Mr. Agarwal to Chief Technology Officer. Agarwal's experience working on the product side helped assuage investors who feared the company was stagnating. But shortly after he was named Twitter's new CEO, Agarwal drew criticism from conservatives as old social media posts and interviews led some to question how Agarwal would handle censorship. Specifically, some conservative commentators pointed to Agarwal telling MIT Technology Review in 2020 that Twitter, like other private companies, isn't bound by the First Amendment, leading some conservative commentators to speculate that Twitter's censorship of right-wing sources will worsen. Beyond the negative political publicity, Twitter does face an uphill battle. Agarwal's job, handed down to him from investors including activist firm Elliott Management, is to grow Twitter to 315 million active users and reach $7.5 billion in revenue by the end of 2023, substantially higher than its current figures. Analysts worry it will be difficult for it to meet the targets set before Dorsey's departure. And Twitter's stock has suffered. The stock dropped more than 40% over the six months before Elon Musk announced he had become Twitter's largest shareholder. But the day of the announcement, Twitter's share price jumped 27%. In early May, Agarwal announced the departure of Twitter's general manager for consumer products and general manager for revenue in a memo to employees. Agarwal also said Twitter was pausing most new hiring and pulling back on discretionary spending. However, the company is not currently planning layoffs. Part of this stems from the company not hitting goals in audience and revenue growth, Mr. Agarwal wrote. But on Twitter, outgoing general manager Kayvon Bakepour said Agarwal asked him to step down because he wants to, quote, take the team in a new direction. On May 13th, Elon Musk said on Twitter that the sale is on hold over his concerns over the number of fake and spam accounts on the site. On Twitter, Agarwal questioned the ability of the company to confirm which accounts are real, to which Musk responded with a poop emoji.